welcome to my channel creative art i am nilima and today we're going to do this easy beautiful and simple miniature water lily acrylic painting this time of lockdown i'm just following my heart and i'm doing what i love to do at home and in today's video friends i will be showing you how i started making miniature paintings by just following my reference and just let the brush go and this is the final look of my miniature paintings i'm also trying a new mediums for example the artist acrylic color which we get in tube as well as the heavy body acrylic colors which i'm absolutely loving and maybe in my next videos you will be able to see some palette knife painting too so do subscribe my channel for more creative art painting videos and do press the bell icon on to get notifications for each video I post every week. All the materials needed to make this beautiful miniature acrylic paintings are mentioned in the description box below with their links from where you can also buy them. They are also shown in the video. So let's start the video now friends. To make this miniature paintings, I'm going to use three different types of acrylic color. The first one is a very basic acrylic color which you get in this kind of bottles. The second one is a medium body artist acrylic color which you get in this kind of tube. So I have bought a whole set of 12 of this tube. Next is definitely a new type. This is artist acrylic color heavy body. So in this painting, you will be easily able to notice the difference between a normal acrylic color, a medium body and a heavy body acrylic color, which is generally done by using a palette knife. So I'm definitely going to use a palette knife in this video and two brushes. One is a flat hair brush number eight and the second is a round hair brush number two. So let's start now friends. Here are all the colors I'm going to use. I'm going to first of all start with white and place white on few parts. I'm clearly observing to my reference and placing colors wherever they are needed. Okay, next I'll take some teal blue, take a little bit of green. this will be the right background so I will let it get dry now this is how our base looks when our shading part is completed so now I'm going to change my color type and I'm going to use the artist acrylic color which comes in this kind of tube and along with that I'm also going to use the artist acrylic heavy body color so I'm using here some pink with just a little bit of pink orange and white these are called medium body paints and these are called heavy body and the colors you get in this kind of bottle these are just normal acrylic paint first of all i'll start from directly using some heavy body paint in my brush and i'm using pink first of all start making the lotus leaves
it is almost completed i'll just place some white paint in this way because i do want to create a few flowers some water lilies and only this time friends i'm going to use my paint brush and i'll try to shape it as petals in this way It's finally completed. I will let it get dry. Now let's remove the tapes. And this is how it finally looks. Let's quickly frame it. So friends, this is how beautiful our water lily acrylic painting looks when I have framed it. So I have made one more which is on the right and that was the first one I started with. I'm going to practice a variety of miniature paintings and I love to paint water lilies and I just love the way it looks when framed. So you can basically frame it in two ways. So this is the first one. I have framed it in twice of the size of its frame with giving a white support so that this miniature painting looks much more brightened up and it quite have a size and the next framing is this one it is actually 3x size of the original painting but that also looks very pretty and elegant so these are both the types you can frame a miniature painting and place it according to the focal point so friends do give it a try make it yourself and do tell me in the comments below what are you doing during your lockdown because i am definitely using my time to brush up my techniques and use so many different mediums i hope you will do the same brush up your hobby and different techniques do what you love at your home this summer and have a safe and happy day thank you for watching